From content creators to vloggers, people use video editors worldwide. Two of those are Camtasia and Filmora. It's for this reason that the Camtasia vs. Filmora debate happens to be a significant. This video compares Camtasia and Filmora to see which one you would consider. What are both? Camtasia is a video editor and screen recording with many transitions, text, and audio effects. Filmora is mainly a video editor, but it is a screen recorder too. Like Camtasia, you find the audio, transition, and title effects in your projects. Overall, Filmora is a bit advanced and offers more features, but both target people newly starting their video editing careers. Tools Both offer transition, text, and audio effects. All Camtasia effects come pre-installed while Filmora has an online library, so you must have an internet connection to download any. However, Filmora has more effects overall than Camtasia. Transition Effects Transitions are the animations that bridge the gap between video clips. Camtasia has a total of 31 transitions, all pre-installed with the tool. Filmora, on the other hand, has over 500 transitions. Those are in their online library, so to view and download any, the internet is a must. Text Titles Camtasia does not have text titles, but with the help of animating features, you can animate text. Of course, this is a DIY map. The tool also comes with annotations, shapes, and keystroke palettes. Filmora comes with over 300 titles as of writing this. All can be found in the title section next to the audio files. And yes, all are online. Video effects. You have a hand in video effects on Camtasia, including sketch motion, shapes, and blur. You find around 15 video effects to take projects to the next level. Elements. Filmora has an additional feature called Elements. Those elements are animated graphics and icons to add to your videos. You get icons such as like, share, and subscribe. Those are great for people uploading videos to social media. Camtasia does not offer such a thing. Audio options. How do audio effects compare in the Camtasia VS? Both come with some audio options, such as removing background noise and adjusting volume control. Regarding the functionalities, Filmora has better and advanced capabilities for audio editing. Both also offer audio files that you can download and use in your project. Cursor effects. Camtasia has 16 cursor effects that you can apply. Some effects include highlight, spotlight, magnify, and cursor smoothing. On the contrary, Filmora has fewer cursor effects. If you're looking for editing software with a wide variety of cursor effects, Camtasia is the better option. Ease of use. Ease of use is a significant part of the Camtasia VS. Filmora. It all depends on the needs of a user and their level of skill and usage. Overall, both are fairly easy to use compared to other programs, such as Premiere Pro and Hit Film Express. Filmora may be a bit challenging because it offers some additional options, such as color adjusting, keyframes, extended exporting options, sequence adjustment, and more, but the time it should take to learn either is just a few hours. Overview. Having compared Camtasia VS, Filmora, you can settle for the one that best fits you. It all comes down to what you want for your video editing projects. Your taste, preferences, and needs are imperative when using either Camtasia or Filmora. The takeaway is that both are great options depending on one's needs and preferences. We are going to end this video right away. If you have any query or information to share, please leave a comment below. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching.